Hello, this is Eric with Pyroboom, and what we have here is a little setup to demonstrate red dragons in what's called parallel. And what I did is I hooked up some red dragons here, and I've exposed the nichrome already, and I just removed the rubber band. And so the reason I did that so you could see it, you would never do that in a real application when you put your foos on there because you wouldn't have anything to clip onto. So what I did, again, is I have... Um, two red dragons hooked up here and two red dragons hooked up here. So this is on Q1 and this is on Q4 and the purpose of this video is to demonstrate if parallel works with the CP uh, with the CP4 module or P4 module. So what I did is I have hooked up already, it's everything's on. On Q number one it's green and, and Q number four is continuity. So let's go ahead and press number one and see if anything, we get any results uh, out of this, see if these two, we want these two both to burn. Let's see what, if we can get anything. And it looks like it burned pretty well. So that's parallel. Let's go ahead and try this one. This one's on Q4. And you got a little smoke there. I don't know if you can see it. We'll just try. So Q4 is actually hooked up to these two guys right here. Let's go ahead and hook this press number four. And we had a real good fire from there. So I would say with confidence, with the one meter, these are one meter red dragons. I would say with confidence, just based upon these two tests, that you can hook these up. Two red dragons in parallel on the C, on the on this uh, P4 module. Now, my personal recommendation is only to do one just to ensure you have 100% firing. Obviously, based on this test it looks pretty good, but to play it safe if you if you want to get good firing, we just recommend only using one. Thanks a lot for watching. Light up the sky and have a great day.